All right, so now let's continue further. Now let's take a look at magnitude or length of a vector. So the magnitude or length of the vector is the length of any of its representations and is denoted by the symbol. You can have this uh, vertical line, then the uh, vector form right here. So the vector V, and then closed uh, line there. Or you can have double lines and then V and then double lines. Uh, yeah, I typically uh, see this one here is the one I use more. Also because this one, I can't really find this on my on my keyboard. <laughs> it was by using the distance formula to compute the length of a segment OP. And uh, we obtained the, f the following formulas. And again, I'll just put a note. Uh, this is from the first video in the um, in this chapter. Yeah, so from that first video I went over uh, the proofs for the three dimensional one and uh, also two dimensional. And so on. So the length of the two dimensional vector a equals to uh, yeah, this vector a uh, this components a one a two is and this is just using yeah, the uh, Pythagorean law. So we'll have uh, the absolute value of a the vector is equals to square root a one squared plus a two squared. So the, you just square the components, add them up and then square root the whole thing. That is in two dimensions, like that. And now in three dimensions, so the length of the three dimensional vector a with components a1, a2, a3 is, and again, the same thing, but you just expand this. So a vector equals to the absolute value of it, or the uh, length is going to be equals to a1 squared plus a2 squared plus a3 squared.